off the school. Yeah, tools falling off, it's fine. awesome it's a total kook I mean this is the true hipster it's like you do your own thing look at him no one told him what to do he's unhappy if he does what people want him to do look at this it's pretty fun it's better when I got a beer in one hand <laughs> yeah exactly so I was just saying when you were off doing your wheelies with yep. a big smile on your face. Yeah. I was saying this was the original definition of hipster, which now everyone hates. Yeah. It was a jazz term originally, and um, it was basically about like kind of creativity, and you, you know, walk to the beat of your own drummer. Yeah. Have and fun every day. Have fun. Do your own weird thing. Yeah. The weirder, the better, because it's just your what you care about, mm -hmm. what you enjoy, and you give joy to others, and you know, there's some practical aspect and now the term is all about like fashion and you know it's yeah. sort of like you have your your frames with no glasses in them and you know it's all about shopping at urban outfitters made in china crap yeah there's nothing real to it and then i see someone like you and it's an you know this guy's an artist and a craftsman and a mm -hmm. you know a joker whatever yeah instead of hips i, I yeah i call myself a hippie redneck yeah because um, i like to drive old cars big trucks and ride my bike every day it works pretty well. I'm wearing an NRA trucker hat. I mean, come on. Power to you, man. This thing kind of fucks up my, my game, but... <laughs> yeah, yeah, so... It's, it's, you know, labels aren't fun. I don't yeah, like labels. labels don't even matter, but I do love to sort of occasionally reclaim that term from the douchiness I like that it. it has drowned in. Yeah. Because originally it meant, do your own thing. There's some sense of eco-responsibility. It doesn't mean craft. getting beard implants. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> beard implants and, uh, you know, a big scarf in the summer with your V-neck. Yeah. Showing below the scarf. Yeah, maybe some ironic necklace. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> With the Bikes and Beer Radio Show, we've been coining new terms, and farmster is one of them. Uh huh. For like the, I'm farming, I'm like an urban farmer, man. It's farmsters. And um, really, you just have some herbs in your window that are yeah. half dead? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm starting to look at it. But I mean, there's a real thing to that. People want to get back to yeah. the land and farm, and that's this is awesome. This is awesome. But when it's all about lifestyle and being cool and Instagramming yourself, doing everything, something's lost. Yeah. As we say, sit here with two video cameras. <laughs> Woo! Cheers to Yenderbilt, Zach Yendra. It's like the James Bond of school bus bikes. Feeling it. 